Okay, she's cute. She even got the plant involved. Okay, you all. So today is Easter weekend. Um, my mother-in-law has the kids. So we're about to go out and get some brunch. I really want some brunch. So freaking bad. This place that we want to go to closes at 2. It's like almost 12 o'clock. And the place is 20 minutes from my house. So we may or may not be going there. Because my husband is like, look, if they about to close, I don't like to go places about to close. So whatever. So got all my earrings. Um... These are, I got Smoky Quartz, Peach Moonstone, and Black Tourmaline. I don't know if I'm going to wear all of this. Oh, and we got the belly out. Okay, she got a little bit of abs coming in. Y'all see them? See the, see the, is abs in the booty? Okay, but I'm going to wear a jacket over this so I don't feel like super exposed. Um, And this is going to make me tuck it in today. So... Uh, yeah, so also I wanted to show you all. I want to smell good and sexy. Okay, so I got some Dossier perfumes. Okay, this is Woody Peony. It gives you a peach, leche, bergamot, fresia, jasmine, orange blossom, peony. And then like the base that really helps to sustain the scent is going to be musk, oak, moss, and woods. This is the best one out of the three that they sent me. I legit love this scent. Okay, so let me get y'all idea of, like what it kind of smells like. How do y'all spray y'all stuff on? I heard people say like they spray right here. And then, you know, back in the day, we always spray at the wrist. And then you'd be spraying all over it. Like, okay, girl, come on. Um, It's just so feminine, so girly, but it's like a sophisticated girly. Um, you can, it's just like a light... It's just a sexy smell. I really can't explain it. it I definitely can smell the bergamot and the jasmine and the orange. Uh, it just smells so pretty. It smells pretty. Get the Woody Peony. I don't know what it's inspired by. I'm going to have to put it on here. Um, because they give they have cosmetics that you all have seen people talk about Dossier um, fragrances. So, I said they give cosmetics. They have scents that are based on um, more popular you know luxury brands this is some fluorite wrapped in copper see if i do this then we're not gonna do this or we're not gonna do these which one yeah we should have the earrings for sure okay two other scents we have are floral marshmallow now this is gonna give you that really girly sugary sweet mm, come take a bite get a little lick in type of smell uh, i've worn this to work surprisingly and i actually like the way it smells when i work because it just smells like more uplifting and it's so girly it's so um it's super girly like the marshmallow like it definitely smells like sweet candy cupcakes vanilla ice cream type of vibes so if you like that type of scent go for it i like wearing it to work because it just uplifts my energy more i like work wearing the woody peony when i work out and also when i'm um like, I want to feel sexy and feminine. It's just a really good everyday scent. Because I've been wearing this for the last week and a half. Just trying to get an idea of, like, what, if I really like them and how it fits me. Because I wear a lot of hats. I'm a mom. I'm a nurse. I'm a student. Graduated from nursing school in four weeks. Okay, I'm be an RN right now. I'm an LPN. But anyways, um, and I, I'm a YouTuber. And, like... I'm wife like I have all of these different hats that I wear so I feel like I should have a scent that fits these different parts of me plus I'm a home girl so I be hanging out you know with the girls living my life and sometimes you just want a scent that fits every facet of you so it's kind of like your costume that you're wearing right this one this one I'm kind of in between with this ambery sage it says that the top note which is like what you smell first is a bitter almond sage sage and lavender the middle note is a leathery notes aureus aureus and vanilla and then the base is amber blonde woods and tonica beans so it's kind of giving like a spicy splice spicy herbal this is very unisex i feel like this is a unisex scent so if you're somebody who's kind of like a tomboyish or like you you want to be a little bit you know ambiguous um androgynous or you just don't necessarily feel like you are always into like sugary like floral scents i feel like this will fit um i like this when i wear this i feel like more like empowered to do stuff so i think this is a good gym scent or if you're like out doing errands going for a hike 
going for a walk, doing something like that takes physical work. I feel like this fits because it just fits the vibe of like, I still smell good, but like, I'm not like super girly right now. If that makes any sense. I, I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know. But I definitely wanted to get scents that like fit all of my personalities because even though I'm like, you know, Kansas, honey, we moody. So our personality is going to change, okay, all day, every day. Um, But yeah, that's all I wanted to show you all. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to wear. I really want to go eat, so I need to hurry up. I need to put on a jacket, but I want it to be like a loose jacket. I could wear this. I don't think it's iron, though. Let me see. That way I don't show up, show, oh, I don't cover my belly all the way, but like I'm not completely exposed but it is kind of wrinkled but it is kind of cute what y'all think i think it's too wrinkled maybe i shouldn't wear this shirt it's like i need it to be tighter i don't know i could tie it too and still show a little bit of skin but also have it tied what do y'all think? Let me know. I think this is cute. I feel like this is cute. Even though it's wrinkled. This is what we wear. I forget it. I ain't about to change. Like, I'm ready to eat. I love you all. I wanted to show you all the plants, too. I don't know if I'm putting this in this vlog. I have no idea. Have you, anybody who does vlogs, like, you'd be like, what day am I on? Like, what are we talking about? I don't freaking know. But look at my plants. I moved them around. I repotted everything. I have to still repot this guy um, and this guy in here. He's looking real crusty, but he is still alive. Got this incense burning, y'all. This is the best freaking incense. I talked about it in another video. This is my husband and I. This is like our incense. We only burn this for ourselves. When there's no kids around, we just chill. We're actually going to burn one in the car. Yes, we burn incense in the car. Um, this is amazing. Um, but yeah, go ahead and check out Dossier fragrances i'm gonna have the link down below it is not an affiliate link you know i don't get any kickback from it but y'all get a discount so go for it you know more videos i do like this the more discounts you will get it's a better way to support the channel um also you all know i sell crystals so go check out my website for that i'm done selling stuff to y'all but i really do like these scents the last one's the only where I, where I was just like i don't know i don't know but it still smells good um Let's see, what are we gonna do for the lips? I'm thinking just, I just put a brown liner in on, and then I put some A&D ointment, y'all. If y'all lips ever get super chapped, A&D ointment, that's where it's at. For real. But then I got this color, I think it's matte though. I don't know how I'm gonna do that today. Maybe just a little, um, a little um yeah and also i feel like this is a really good room scent i know this is like for your body but i will legit spray this all over my house i think this smells so good as like it's just a unisex scent that's just like i don't know how to explain it i don't know how to explain it i don't know if this is like part of my signature scents that i'm because i want to have more signature scents um and i feel like wearing a fragrance is just an easy way to just feel more feminine to feel more like i don't know especially when you're like out with your kids and stuff and you're like mm, this me crazy. then you get a whiff of how you smell you be like you know what bitch i'm a goddess okay these kids is my kids we're gonna be all right all right i'm about to go yeah i love you all bye what it smell like hmm it smells better than that cheap mall perfume you always get um in the sense of <laughs> A scent of Woody and Peony. It's for sure the best perfume you've ever had. Thanks. Thank you. I'm sure Dossier will be very thankful to you too. Yeah, thanks, Dossier. My wife finally smells her age and not like a 60 year old woman with <laughs> the damn Bath and Body Works perfume. Really? Oh, don't, nah, don't come for Bath and Body. You know what? I gotta go. <laughs> he came for the tried and true. Whatever, you a hater. Mm -hmm. Hey y'all, I was gonna show you my food, but then we started, I was hungry, child. But yeah, we had a good eat, uh, not evening, day together. Um, I just wanna, you know, take this little second to talk to the folks that are married, that are coupled up, specifically the married folks. I've been married for 10 years. 
I know it's hard, y'all. It's a challenge. It can be very exhausting mentally and emotionally, um, which then makes it physically exhausting. But keep going forward, y'all. Get the help that you need. Communicate with your partner. Of course, if it's you feel like this person is your person, just do the work. Just keep showing up to do the work. And things are going to get so much better, so much more rewarding. But I know it's like a, it seems like it's a lot of energy, especially when I watch like tarot videos and stuff like that. It's a lot of energy about like, let him go, girl. But you know, hold on to him. Hold on to him or her. Okay. I love y'all. Bye. Y'all, people still don't wash their hands after they leave the bathroom. You don't wash your hands after you leave the bathroom. I don't do these. I'm good. <laughs> Be careful. We're walking in the rain. It may sound crazy. May sound crazy. Wanna, wanna go outside. In the rain. Oh, that's a big muddy puddle. Ooh. I it's, it's dirty, Rara. Gosh. It's stuck. You're stuck. Oh, we're not stuck. Uh. She's like, uh, this ain't right. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, be careful. Oh, Ooh, you're gonna have to get that mud off y'all's feet. This can't do it, mommy. Uh-uh, my feet can't get wet. I don't have little rubber boots like you. I wish I did. It may sound crazy. It may sound crazy. Gonna, gonna go outside. In the do, 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 do. The sun is sunny. Oh, my friend. And the raindrop. Okay, y'all don't know this thing. <laughs> In the flame. What's up, y'all? We outside walking in the rain. My husband went to get some cheesecake and he got some other stuff for his stuff. I just made myself a little bit of food and he's gonna go get some cheesecake. And I was like, why not take the kids for an itty bitty walk? Because everybody's gonna go to sleep soon. And I'm like, I mean, it's raining, it is what it is. Like, it's every season. You better live your life. Come on, girls. Come on, Rara. Okay. Eat the mommy. Right, right. It's a snake. It's a snake. It's a snake. Ah! Ooh. Be careful. Now y'all can wash off your feet. Good job. It's a bit cold. The fro is getting wet. I don't know how long this is going to last. Yes. Oh, put your hood on, baby. Hold on. Get over here. This is my Aries. Mommy. That's my Scorpio. Yes, baby. Now I don't see you. I see your head. Ah! The Scorpio, of course, wants to hide and sneak up on you. 
in the area is like, shoot, I'm just gonna live my life. I ain't even paying attention. Yeah, puddle. another puddle. Be careful. Yeah, don't splash each other. Okay, never mind. Ooh. And more cheese. Cheese Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. <laughs> Where do you get that from? Oh gosh, y'all, it's cold. But I'm like trying to stay warm. Let them live their little baby lives. Oh, how have y'all been doing? Mini life update. I graduated from nursing school in four weeks. Um, then after that, I'm gonna take my nursing exam. My last time having to take this exam. I already took it before to get my LPN. Okay, don't step in that, baby. Get off the grass. Let's go down the steps. All right, took it from LPN. If I decide to go further and get my, now I'm getting my associate's degree in nursing. If I decide to go further and get my bachelor's degree, I won't have to do it again. This is my last time doing it. It's like 200, ooh, these are some big puddles. It's like 200 bucks. So do that. And then after that, the goal is to only do YouTube crystals and any other ways of making money except for going to clock in for somebody else. Okay, y'all, that's too much. Uh, doing that for the remainder of the year. That's the goal. That's what we're working on. That's what we're manifesting. That's the goal. Spend more time with the family. Feel more free, more open, and just more relaxed, you know. I'm looking forward to being more relaxed for the second half of this year. Really going into... The first and middle part of the Astro New Year, um, because every season is the start of the new year. Put that down. So that's that. I love you all. And muddy puddles. Oh gosh, this looks really, really dirty. Look at the area. She like, uh, okay. <laughs> okay, let's walk back. Go up the steps. Go up the steps. So what are you all up to? Like, do you have plans for the summer? My summer is going to be lit, 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 lit. Come on, girls. We got play dates. We're going to learn how to swim. Put the girls in martial arts. I really want to put the girls in gymnastics. Chris is really big on martial arts, which I'm okay with, but I feel like gymnastics is really good for um, strength training. Um, and I think they would love to tumble and all that good jazz. Come on, Ra Ra. Put your head on. No, we're going back towards the house. Come on. And then my goal for myself is I really am thinking about either starting an herbalist course in the fall and becoming a yoga instructor. I know somebody who was already a yoga instructor and she told me that a new class is starting in June. It's kind of close. It's kind of cutting it close because I plan on working at other jobs as a nurse until like June 26. So I don't want to be too close to that. But I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna let everything flow, y'all. I'm letting everything flow. Uh uh, Maddie. Now you're getting the mud back on your feet. Clean the mud off. Okay. Now walk up. Walk back up. I'll probably get back to selling these earrings. Y'all can see all the, the rain on my eyes. Okay, no, no, no. Done with the mud. Go get a puddle. Go play with a puddle. Um, Keep going. Doing more crystal jewelry, more collaborations. I do have another project that I really, 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 really want. And I'm super excited about it. I'm not going to talk about it. Come on, Rara. I have like actually three to four projects that I really, really want. Go this way, girls. Go. But a few things... You know, I gotta come into fruition first. And I just need to clear my plate off. Once I get done with school and I take my state board exam, okay, yeah, I just gonna look like that. Once I get done with school and I take that exam and I for sure have my Orion license, it's gonna free up a lot more time. So I'm just going through with the flow. Um, but yeah, I'm interested in knowing like, keep going. I need some boots to go in the puddle. I mean, I got boots, but I don't want to get them. Can I just step over it? Okay. Woo. Stepped over the... Oh, God, I got some of my eyes, child. No, I can't go now either? It's so cold. 
Do it again. Do it again. Step over again. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> um, I don't even know what I was saying, but I'm interested in knowing what's going on with you all. Okay, let's go back in. Uh, we got to take our boots off. It's raining. It's so cold. Yeah, my boots. My boots are wet. Okay, take them off right at the door. Right here. Oh, yeah, it started to literally right as soon as we got to the door. It started to rain way heavier out here. Y'all can hear it. Mariah, I told you, oh, take off your shoes at the door, not run through the house. Oh, Chad, these kids, Chad. Take them off. So, yeah, that's that, y'all. I love y'all. This is like our mantra. Let that go. Be balanced. Be happy. I love you all. Uh, that's my little update so far. Um, I'll see you all later.